Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to talk about something that's still an issue. This is a serious issue for me because sometimes I get attacked this way and I just want to share with you what happened. So I was just reading a post about, um, it was, it was something stupid where people were saying that if you're fat, you're not healthy. That's not true. It's not true. Trust me. So here are my Facebook posts that I put out. Um, what I said was, the sign of your body has nothing to do with health. There are plus size people who are healthy, which is true for me. As long as your doctor says you're healthy, that's all that matters. And then I get a, a reply. Um, Victoria D. Salam Hewton. I don't really care if I said that right. Um, she said, define healthy. Will an overweight person suffer numerous um, illnesses that directly relate back to their weight? Will an over per overweight person suffer emotionally? from the things that relate directly back to weight. Does a person's weight directly affect numerous aspects of their daily life? Really? I'm a big girl. I'm proud to be a big girl. I'm, ha I'm happy in my own skin. So you can say whatever you want. I'm not going to care. I really don't. Then J.B. Swa, S.W.E., I don't know if that's a real name or a fake name, but either way, he's a douche. It says, there had, I don't think he can spell correctly, I don't. This BS is only made up for big unhealthy people to clean their guilt conscious of being that size. In the end, being overweight is not healthy. Political correctness is killing, is directly killing people. Again, your weight has nothing to do if you're healthy or not. For me, if your doctor says you're healthy, fine. Don't let these skinny ass bitches say otherwise. Then I replied, this was the last reply I did because I was like so over these assholes. I think so. No, there's one more. <laughs> there's one more. Yeah. It says, as long as the doctor says they are healthy, that's all that matters. How much you weigh does not define if you're healthy or not. Which it does not. And I said, Victoria, you can't make people lose weight. It's up to them only. If you don't like it, don't look at them. It's true. Um, I really don't care what people say about my body because I'm happy in my own skin. I don't need to be a size zero to be happy. I'm happy in my skin. I'm like a 20, 30 pants and I don't care. I don't. Um, if you're going to try to fat shame somebody because you don't like their weight, they look too big to you. So how could they possibly be healthy? One, you don't know their background. They can have numerous um, health conditions that has nothing to do with their weight. Not a thing. There are health issues where you gain weight even though you're eating healthy. If you're eating healthy and exercising, there are numerous um, diseases that you can get that will make you gain weight. It's not always because you're just sitting on the couch all day and just eating and not exercising. It's not always the case. Um, there were people who are eating right, exercising, and still gaining weight. So you can't tell me that the only diseases that a person of my size will get is because of my weight. It's not true. I've never had a doctor say, I'm unhealthy. Unless I have a doctor tell me personally that I'm unhealthy, I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing because what I'm doing is working. It's okay. There's no doctors saying you should lose weight. Unless I have my own personal doctor tell me that I need to lose weight because it's not healthy for me, then not. If you don't like it, go fuck yourself. 
go turn around, walk away because I'm not going to care. And if you're going to call me names, you better be prepared. Because I'm part Irish, I'm part Native American, and I have a hot temper when people try to bully me. If you're going to talk about my weight, like really hateful things, I'm going to stare you right in the face and say, try me, bitch. And I don't, I don't just call girls bitches either. I call guys bitches too. Because if you're going to act like a bitch, I'm going to call you a bitch. I am not the type of woman to start saying that I look so big or some stupid little joke just to make your little ass feel better. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm happy in my own skin and that bothers you? Too bad. We should all be happy in our own skin. It's really hard for women to do that because society says we should all be a size zero because that's healthy. That's not healthy. There are women out in the world, believe it or not, who will starve themselves to death to be skinny. There are women that have a disease where they will eat and then they'll purge and all you see is just skin and bones on them because they want to be skinny. They're not skinny enough. They are dying to be skinny, literally. So don't say that I'm fat and I'm ugly because I'm happy in my body. Don't be saying all that bullshit to me because it's not going to fly with me. I don't care what you think of me. I haven't cared what people thought of me since 2005. That was the year I graduated high school and I haven't given a fuck since. So don't tell me that I'm fat and I need to lose weight. Are you a doctor? Do you have a medical degree? Do you know my health history? No. Don't say shit. I'm not going to stand by and let people say these mean and ridiculous things if it's in person, if it's online, if it's on social media. It's not going to happen with me. You want to say shit to me? I dare you to say it to my face. Because you will get something that you will regret. Trust me. So if you are a big person <laughs> like me, it's okay to be who you are. The only thing I request from you is that if your doctor says it's okay, don't care what people say. Go by what your doctor says. If your doctor says you are healthy, screw the size zero bitches. Just screw them. Um, if your doctor says you are un unhealthy and you need to lose weight, I will listen to him. He has a medical degree, he's your doctor, and he has your medical history. That is the only person I would listen to. Not these little skinny ass bitches who think they're all that in a bag of chips. It's not going to happen. You can be a size zero and be unhealthy. Don't believe me, it happens. There are people who are a size zero and they're unhealthy because they're doing stuff they shouldn't be doing to stay a size zero. So, you like how I look? Or don't. I'm going to step back to the wall so you can see my full body. Because I don't care. So I'm stepping back all the way to the wall. I'm a big girl and I don't really care what you think. Um, I'm going to move the camera down a bit so you can see my stomach. Because I don't care. I have a big stomach. So what? What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Because I don't give a fuck what you think. I'm a big girl. I'm proud of it. My doctor says I'm healthy. That's all that matters to me. You can say, I'm unhealthy. Well, guess what? I'm not going to care what your skinny ass says. Because you're probably skinny and you're probably unhealthy. You want to call me fat and unhealthy? I'll call you skinny and unhealthy. How's that? Don't mess with me. I don't care what people say. I'm not going to stand by and let somebody get shamed because the type of body they have. God gave him that body. Apparently, he was okay with it. Just because you're not okay with it, it's none of your business, especially if you don't even know them. If they are a complete stranger to you, you have no right to say shit. 
I know I'm heated right now. It's because I can't stand it when people think it's okay to say that you're too fat based on your size, you're unhealthy. That is not always the case. Sometimes it's the case, it's not always the case. Again, they can have mental, um, not mental, helpful issues that makes them gain weight even though they do everything right. If they do everything right, they're still gaining weight. It's a, it's a little, it's a legitimate health issue. People have health issues where they can eat right, they can exercise, they can do everything the doctor says, and they still gain weight. And no, it's not because they're cheating on the diet. They're not cheating. They're doing everything they're supposed to do, and they still gain weight. It's a health issue. I've seen it. So don't even say it's because they're cheating. No, they're not. It's okay to splurge every once in a while. So you can't be happy unless you eat something that's a guilty pleasure. Mine are mostly on TV. <laughs> but it's okay to do that every once in a while. But if you're going to stand up and you are going to say, I'm unhealthy because of my size, go fuck yourself. That's all i got to say about that. If you agree with me that your body does not define how healthy or unhealthy you are, please give me a like. I love to see people who will stand up for each other. That's what we need to do. We need to stand up for each other and tell the idiots who think they have the right because they have a big mouth to say whatever they can to say to us. We are not going to take it. We are not going to stand for it. You don't like my weight? Don't look at me. That's all I got to say about that. So, to everybody who agrees with me, give me a like, because that will let me know that you support what I'm saying and that you support that nobody has the right to say whether you are healthy or not if they're not your personal doctor. That's the only person who can say it. The only person who can say that you are okay the way you are or you need to lose weight is your personal doctor. They have the degree to do so. They have your medical history to say so. So if, if anybody other than your doctor says it, tell them to go fuck themselves. I would because I'm not going to stand for it. Um, if you're not comfortable doing that, totally fine. Ignore their dumbasses. Because apparently there's a lot of them. That I have to say this message again. So please like, share, and subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. I can't wait for the next idiot to say something to me. Because I'm not going to stand for it. And if you have any questions or comments that you don't want to leave in the comment section, there's an email in the description below where you can send me a private email that I personally will get and I will read and we can talk to each other um, if you're having issues because people are fat shaming you for some stupid reason. Ugh. Skinny bitches, I swear. I will talk to you. I will tell you what has happened to me that could possibly help you. I want to help you be happy in your own skin. The only person, again, the only person who can say anything about your health is your doctor. That's it. Nobody else has the right to say anything. So if you want to send me a message that is a private message, go to in the description below and click on the email that I have linked for you. I read my emails every single day. I get notifications about them so I can see them as soon as I get them and I will reply to you if it's a question you have. Um, or if you have a video idea, I will write down the video idea. I will respond to your email if you have a video idea telling you thank you and telling you when it will come out. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. I hope it was helpful for you. Um, you, can <laughs> you can share it to some of the idiots in your life that think that you're unhealthy because of your weight, which they're just stupid. And I will tell them myself if you share this. Because it's not right that people do this. So please, like, share, and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys next time.